Well, history was made in Parkside today as a first of its kind black owned business in Philadelphia celebrated its grand opening. Action News Racing Culture reporter Taronda Thomas tells us how the massive new facility will have an impact far beyond city limits. This new $25 million facility is poised to make a difference not just here in Parkside, but in the national medical field, and it's entirely black owned. <laughs> Celebrating the grand opening of Super Office Solutions and EMSCO Scientific Enterprises on West Jefferson Street in Parkside, they came together to create Philadelphia's first African American owned cryopreservation facility. We started. Back in 2011, Ishmael Shahid is one of the three owners, all black men. It's something he couldn't even dream of growing up just two blocks away. To put it right here inside of a neighborhood that I actually grew up in, it's this is just unbelievable. Putting the facility here in Parkside was intentional and transformational. This was a blighted area for almost the last 30 years. It was a dump site. We had many opportunities to go closer to the universities and the Eds and Meds, but we decided to bring and put this fabric within the community. The 70,000 square foot facility holds offices and a cryopreservation facility. We can store at minus 80 degree, minus 180 degree temperatures, cell, gene, and tissue culture. So if you think about DNA, there's also warehouse space for critical medical supplies, something that takes on personal significance after the business's fourth partner died from COVID. They persevered with support, including from Senator Vincent Hughes. But this is how it's done. And from the community. We are very committed to the general community. Making history while also making an impact. This hopefully will be encouragement to others. The companies are looking to grow to a staff of 100, creating jobs as they grow their business. In Parkside, Taronda Thomas, Channel 6 Action News.